<laughs> Puppets, man. <sighs> Is it cool to be like a puppeteer or something? I don't know. What's cool anyways these days? Man. So people are way better at controlling other people rather than themselves, you know? It's all this manipulation, you know, it's, I don't know, man. It's getting way, way too popular, way too, way too aggressive. I feel like it's all people practice these days. It's just puppeteering and manipulation. <sighs> you know, playing, being puppet masters. All people do is play with your mind, emotions, and feelings. Control your thoughts, put thoughts into your fucking head. All they do, that's all they do. That's all they want to practice. But like, you know, like, like, I feel like I've moved past that. I've made amends with that stuff. So they are literally nothing. So this is literally just like, it could still happen. It probably will happen. You can't say it's, it's not going to happen. But I feel like I've gone past it and then like I've worked past it. So, but you know, it's going to happen again. You know, that's just reality. That's just common sense, I guess. It's not that I expect it. I, I really, I think I work on myself so I don't have to expect it when it's kind of like a known fact that that's, there's people out there that are just puppet masters. And that's all they want to do. Play, be Pinocchio, you know? Like they, they lie, their nose grows, and then what happens? I don't know. I guess, I guess they become a real boy somehow, you know? I don't know. I'm not, I'm not as, what's the dude's name? What's his, what's his dad's name? I don't, I don't remember that. I don't remember that shit. <sighs> yeah, man. Being a puppet. Being a fucking puppet, you know? Um, I don't know why people need that shit. But they're losing. They can't. They're losing. They're losing discipline. They don't care. They, they can't have any discipline. They're, they're the weakest fucking link. You know, I think, you know what? You know, you know what I discovered when I moved past this stuff? Was they want... They literally want to be able to kill you with their miserable energy, with their, with their hate, miserable lameness. So, I guess this is what they think that that they can um, wear you out so much that your body will not be able to handle the the extreme amount of uh, loser negativity, and you'll die of a heart attack or like become dead. I'm like, man, you're you're really betting on that, aren't you? Imagine if you ended up killing someone because you're like, fucking, I'm sucking you to death. I'm being so weird with my energy. Like your emotion is so crippling or something that you kill someone. Like, what are we staring at, goats? You know, like, if you do that, you know, you're gonna bring the entire world down. And you don't think that. If you're not fucking dead and you feel like that, how is that going to kill someone? If it don't kill you first, how is it going to kill someone? How is that going to kill someone when it doesn't even kill you? So think about that. And plus, why would you want to kill someone when you're the miserable person? Like, dude, like, if you end up killing people because you can deterior deteriorate their mind and heart with your with your miserable energy and your presence. You're that powerful with your miserable negative energy. <sighs> like if you do, like everyone would die and everything would die and you'd kill everything. You'd be the, you'd be responsible for killing everything in the fucking world. It's not going to happen, dude. If you're still alive, obviously something in life is is cheering for for humanity here. Um, so, but it's weird when people do act like that and they, and they can mess, make you mess up, make you trip, make you forget things. And it's all just making you want it. They want you to be as miserable as them. So you do it to other people. So you end up killing people with your negative energy. Dude, that's cheap. Stop thinking that. You are sick. You need help. And this is going to help you. So this is going to help you. So literally, like, people have this voice in their fucking head, you know, that, like, makes them believe shit. And it's not even necessarily true. It's like, I think it's just 
the way that people are like dealing with I guess I think it's the, the inner narcissist in all of us they, everyone has narcissism you probably think I'm a narcissist I, I do have narcissism inside everyone's got a little bit of narcissism it's all moderation some people take it to an extreme the other thing is no narcissism like we all have narcissism in us just accept it I, I have to and you can do something about it. You don't have to really, you can be a, like, you can use it for good, you know. Like, I only try to use my narcissism for sending a, a, a better message to to be, to get over a lot of narcissism. But I know we can't get rid of narcissism, but it's all about moderation. I'm not too abusive. I really feel like I have more good stuff than bad. I don't really think I, I don't know, I don't even know if, if I do any fucking harm, but all I really want to do harm to is, is all the, the real toxic shit. And that's why I sound, that's why I'm like toxic or I sound toxic or I, I just feel like I just need a, a better, I'm using, I, if I have toxic stuff, at least I got a good message where I'm trying to have a, a better effect on the world and improve my life because I can't stand being toxic. I can't stand toxicity. All I do is to deal with abuse and stuff like that. Oh, I don't want to deal with it, whatever. <sighs> you know, go deal with it or I'll do it for you. So I end up doing it for him. So you got to know the inner narcissist inside you so you can like, you know, deal with it and, and get over it. And then you can have your bliss and your, and your positive stuff, your, your positive state. So all this like antagonism and antagonization, antagonism and like puppeteering is like, man, you're just wasting your time. You're really, you, you know, like you're not going to get anywhere with that feeling there. Like either you're going to have to die because of that shit, which is not going to happen. Or you're going to get over it and you're going to enjoy a nice sunny day. That will make your fucking life. It's like, I don't know what, I don't know how much, I don't know how you feel like that. What made you feel that negative and that shitty and that loserish? What accumulated to make you feel like that? <clears throat> but it definitely isn't someone else's fucking problem. And don't make it someone else's problem, you know? Like, it's going to become a problem if, if you end up killing people with your fucking presence. That's crazy, man. So, I think the worst thing that's happened to me, because this has happened where I've, I've gone unconscious because of it before, so it has been, it used to be really bad, um, probably 20 years ago, um, when people really started doing this shit to me. But uh, I literally just passed out, and then I like regained consciousness, got right back up. But it was out of it was out of will because their 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 negativity was so powerful that I was there like oh fuck it and it's just like fall down to see what the fuck happens or something like, uh. but like you know it was like man this is stupid you don't even die you just like regain all your powers like this is literally just like a crazy little reality like a like a like a, a front or something so but that's what I've made amends with you know I've, I've gone past that and. I never wanted people to deal with it and go through that shit because I wanted to damn kill it myself. I wanted to divert, I wanted to end that shit. And there's not, not a lot of that going on, at least right now in my apartment. Like, who knows? Who knows? But there's, there's like some weak people out there doing shit like that. So hopefully you don't have to deal with that. But if you do, just know that <clears throat> you're not going to die. And I don't know, man. It's freaky sometimes because you, you feel like you're coming down and you're confused and stuff. But that's that's massive manipulation right there. <clears throat> but um, I don't know, man. I guess I guess just get away from them or treat them like they treat you. You know what are they gonna do? Die? Like it's it's it's, it's stupid, man. It's just, it doesn't it doesn't make any it doesn't make any sense and there's no use no no use in it. So this is what people do to uh, harass. Uh, me and people i guess and use this as their secret weapon is is the weak the weak bomb the loser the loser a bomb yeah so bunch of puppeteering you know i don't know i guess i guess they're just afraid to to be a man or they, they don't want to grow up they they're not a real boy i don't know damn man stop that puppeteering shit man